Ey! <clears throat> What's good, y'all? Welcome back to the channel, man. It's your boy, Justin. Sorry. Hold on. And, um, today, look, man, y'all read the title. You know what I'm about to tell y'all. Um, welcome to another week. Um, it is Sunday. So, you know, this, this video is obviously about football by the title of the video. Um, so we are going to talk about this Patriots and Jets game that I just got done, you know what I'm saying, watching a couple hours ago. Um, I would say it. I thoroughly enjoyed this game. Um, besides the fact that this O-line for some reason still can't seem to get these goddamn blocking this blocking together and the fact that, you know, the penalties was obviously killing them. Um, we did happen to come out with the W, which is great. Um, shout out to Gronkowski for finally being healthy and, and um, getting the touchdown since um, I think this was his first one since week one. Um, Julian Edelman as well had one. Um, Sonny Michelle had a big game. James White had a big game. Our running game was on, honestly, you know what I'm saying? Probably the most consistent thing we had all game working for us um, was our run game and the fact that our receivers finally were able to catch some pa some passes. Um, like I said, penalties was obviously a big part of the reason why, you know what I'm saying, we didn't really manage to blow them out. I expected a blowout, I'm going to say it. I expected a blowout. But... Um, with the fact that we had so many goddamn penalties. You know, I feel like these refs nowadays become like so goddamn penalty happy. Like they just throw flags for anything. You know what I'm saying? Because they got so many dumbass rules where it's like you can't even tackle the player or else it's a damn flag. You know what I'm saying? Like I was watching the game, right? Tom Brady was out here getting hit like five seconds after the fact that he had released the ball. You know what I'm saying? We get like one rough in the passer call when this man's getting hit like five different times after the play is already over. Like where is our, our penalties at? Where is our holding calls at? Our goddamn rough in the passer calls at? You know what I'm saying? Our offside calls. Meanwhile, we're over here making simple fucking tackles. Oh, that's rough in the passer. Um, that's a hold. You know what I'm saying? Making good plays. Um, Defensively, I'm going to say the first half, I think Gilmore had an interception, which was cool. You know what I'm saying? He he obviously has been struggling these past weeks, but Gilmore had a bounce back week. Um, Jason McCourty as well had a good play at the end of that game. Um, shout out to him. You know what I'm saying? I feel like this combination between Jason McCourty and Devin McCourty has been working. For some reason, I don't know why. You know what I'm saying? But I feel like, obviously, Jason McCourty came here to prove something. You know what I'm saying? Um, and, it's, and it's worked. So I'm, I'm extremely happy that he's been, he's been um, able to adjust to the way that we play over here in New England. Um, since he obviously came from the Cleveland Browns and, you know what I'm saying, that um, epitome of a team. Speaking of the Browns, they got a W today. Again, I think that's their fourth win. Uh, and the Giants lost to the Eagles. And now they're 3-8. and eight. <laughs> Like, I want to know... Here's my question, right? Like, every time, it seems like every time the Patriots lose, it's some type of headline. Like, any team could lose on Sunday, right? The Falcons, the Cowboys, the Saints, the Eagles... Anybody can lose, right? I don't care what other team loses, but anytime the Patriots lose a game any week, it's goddamn a headline. You know what I'm saying? Oh, these, these dudes have fell off. You know what I'm saying? And then we come back the week after and we win a game and it's like now they, you know what I'm saying? The headlines don't, don't come back. You know what I'm saying? Niggas just forgot that they was talking shit about us last week because we lost to the damn Titans. Guarantee you on Monday, they ain't going to be no type of headline. Niggas ain't going to be talking about nothing. Meanwhile, the Titans lost last week. They probably losing tomorrow to the Texans. 
um, Dion Lewis, you're trash. You know what I'm saying? Sony Michelle is better than you. I don't know who Dion Lewis is. James White was the better um, running back that we've had um, these past few years. You know what I'm saying? Um, he was better than you in any Super Bowl that we've been to. Um, you were never productive in any Super Bowl. You disappeared in that Falcon Super Bowl. You know what I'm saying? Talk your shit about us anytime you want, but you're trash. You know what I'm saying? You wouldn't have a name in the NFL if it wasn't for the Patriots to even give you a chance to make a name for yourself. You know what I'm saying? So sit there and shut up. Anyways, this game was great. You know what I'm saying? Um, I think this makes us 11-1 and one against like our division rivals or whatever you want to call it. Um, whenever we get a, like a, a blowout loss. You know what I'm saying? So that's cool. You know? I thoroughly, like I said, thoroughly enjoyed watching this game. I think next week we play the Minnesota Vikings. I'm not too sure how they played offensively. I know they got some weapons. I know they got some weapons on offense. They got Stephon Diggs and Adam Thielen, who's been having an amazing season. Um, defensively, um. I don't know. <laughs> like, I don't watch the Minnesota Vikings enough to just sit here and tell you that we we should win. As much faith as I got in my team to say we're going to win, I'm going to roll with it. You know what I'm saying? I'm giving us this W next week because it's my team. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to say the Patriots win next week just because it's my team and I got enough faith in Tom Brady, who has experience, to just go ahead and say that we should win this game. Um... You know what I'm saying? We do got big name receivers like Josh Gordon and Gronkowski, hopefully, who has another big game next week. Obviously, we're going to need it. Um, hopefully, Julian Edelman. Also, Chris Hogan showed up today, which was good. You know what I'm saying? Because he's disappeared this season. Um, he had a couple good plays, a couple big plays when needed, too. Um, so that's good. Hopefully, if everyone stays healthy, for next week, we should be able to take care of Minnesota. Move to nine and three. I think right now we're eight and three, so we should be able to move to nine and three next week, and then get ready for. I want to say the Dolphins, but I'm not too sure we play after. Um, but anyways, it was a pretty good game. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Um, we're eight and three heading into Minnesota, so, so yeah. I would say say something about Minnesota, but I really don't like watch Minnesota Vikings games. I'm gonna watch this um Monday this um Sunday night game that they have against the Packers. Um just to get a look at how they play. So I know what to expect on Sunday against this goddamn team. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully our defense shows up again. Um and hopefully this whole line can give Brady enough time to throw the ball and move down the field. And our receivers have another good good week um but that's gonna do it for this video y'all hope you enjoyed this video if you did make sure that you hit that like button give this video a thumbs up subscribe to the channel as well if you haven't already um make sure that you also have those notifications turned on and post notifications by hitting that black bell on the side of the subscribe button and um leave a suggestion down below let me know what else you want to see me post more of on this channel I love each and every single last one of y'all with all my heart. Thank y'all for watching. Hope you enjoy the rest of your weekend. I will see y'all tomorrow. Peace. I got my permit test tomorrow. So, I got to take a permit test for, like, driving. So, that should be fun. Good luck to me there. See y'all tomorrow. See y'all tomorrow, boy. The camera is still on. Why is the camera still on, you ask? Because I need my minutes. The more minutes I get, the more minutes I have. 
ซีเรียมอ